My husband's lunch again. <laughs> He's got a um, bottle of water, uh, two sandwiches on whole wheat bread with lettuce and uh, I don't know, Miraclip and mustard and some sort of weird pressed chicken meat stuff. <laughs> no, it's like a lunch meat. And Swiss cheese. I hope you like Swiss. We don't, I don't buy Swiss because I don't like it. <laughs> okay. uh, carrot sticks from Real Carrots. And lace potato chips. And one placenta cookie. And some trail mix. I'm just kidding. It's not a placenta cookie. <laughs> it was just the cookies I was making during my placenta song. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, go back and watch the video response. Okay, that's good. Now we're going to go take it to him. He is planting hay on Heber's place. He is planting hay at Heber's. That's dad right out there planting. I need to go get him his lunch, and I'm not sure the best way to get it to him. So we'll just chat for a minute. So, like eight years ago, we were going to buy this place. Look at the nice garden and shop and house. And there's the sprinkler pipe. <laughs> It's about 80 acres, it just sits right here on the highway, it's seven miles from our house, and we were kind of in negotiations with the owners to buy it, and then they changed their mind and they didn't want to sell it to us, which is okay. There's a little, a little playhouse back there, so cute. You know, I get it. They have a vacation home on Henry's Lake, which is this amazing, beautiful place, and they thought that could be their primary residence, but in the wintertime, they get snowed in and they have to snowmobile out which sounds fun but I mean like packing groceries and stuff in there I mean that would be very painful and difficult and they're in the early 70s I imagine I imagine that's old there I don't know it just it'd be kind of tough but then this other place came along and it was a good deal well it was a deal <laughs> it was okay but we've considered it a blessing so we just um we bought it but I remember being pregnant with Ella and thinking I have to move but it's a really cute little house. It's nice. It's got a little upstairs and the main floor and then it's got a basement and it's got like a little greenhouse here on the front and a garage. And their place up, their vacation home is like almost identical to this place, I think. Okay, let's go find Daddy. Legitimate farming footage. There's Johnny. He is loading up the planter with the alfalfa seed. This is uh, new seeding. He's just trying to thicken it up, I believe. I don't know anything about farming. <laughs> no, I think that's what's happening. So, anyway, this is a 80 acre piece. It has a half pivot on it. Where's the pivot? Oh, it's down there. Pivot. Where's my finger? Ah, there it is. Pivot. <laughs> that's the pivot. Um, so it, it waters a half a circle here. And see these other guys? They they probably water a full circle. And there is Howard W. Hunter. <laughs> anyway president of the church a long time ago. Okay, so, and then um, my kids hate this farm because you saw the sprinkler pipe in the last little section when I was showing you the yard up there, you know, blatantly <laughs> filming my neighbors without their permission. Um, they have to lay out the sprinkler pipe. So you have a, a square divided in half. So it's a, a long rectangle. And let me draw this for you. Against the wind. Pulling out his earbuds. He's so cute. Food for me. Okay. Food. I'll show you my picture in a minute. So these are some fuel tanks at the dairy, and they are pouring little footings and like little walls around them. It's kind of cool. Um, as soon as they're done down here, they're gonna pour me some sidewalks. I think our neighbor dude. There's his little his little skidster. Um. Anyway, hopefully we're trading him a cow for concrete work. And I don't know, we'll settle up in the end, I guess, to see like how many hours he works and all that stuff, but that's going to be really nice. They poured some up to John's parents' place, little walls, so. It's on the back of this very beautiful little thing that Trish made me. Oh, so sweet. And don't tell her that I put it on the back here. <laughs> okay, so like the farm down there at Hebers, it's 80 acres, so it kind of shaped like this. This little circle here, it's the part that's all under pivot. So the pivot, the pivot waters this. It's centered. It goes right here. Like lines come out and it goes, and then it goes back, and it just waters and waters in little like that. But these little lines represent sprinkler pipes that my kids have to lay out, and they are 40 feet long and um, three inches in diameter. No, not in diameter. Yes, diameter. Yes, 
So, um, anyway, they're heavy, and especially when they have water in them. So you have to, um, you have to land down. But I think that they have enough pipe for the entire place, so they don't actually have to move the pipe, except for when they cut the hay. But when the kids found out we were renting Heber's place, they were very sad, because they don't like laying out the pipe. And I need to go home and get some long pants for Carter, because he wore shorts to school. And baby needs something. <laughs>